Okay, I want to I want to I want to read something to you so that everybody understands. This last page that I had, I had 20 views. Okay, or 20 subs. All right, um, the one I got now, I've got five. Okay. Colors vinyl windows with triple. Okay, here's the deal. I had 20 subs on the page that I just shut down. Um, I had a guy called Fractal Code that was bugging me and saying all of this stuff. And supposedly it was supposed to be this one of the ones guys. So the individual that it was came forward and he said, yeah, that was me, you know. Um, I had been told by this one of the ones guys that you were working with Queenie and Aaron. And now I found out that he's a blah, blah, blah. So the guy wrote this to me. It's J Cherry 73 He said, I can't lie. Fractal, fractal code was me. I created it months ago to argue with Starscream, and one of the ones had me convinced that you, meaning me, were an agent. It, it, my bad for trusting wolves in sheep's clothing. I apologize for what I said, and now I know I was being manipulated. The guy had me convinced that you were code talking and working with Aaron and Queenie as a psy psyops on the Christian YouTube community. Well, I can tell you that's not true. Um, I went on my fractal page because I didn't want to fight, just say a couple of things and go. I've been following you and one of the ones now for over a year, and now he betrayed me and all of his subs. I put myself in the position by believing in what I thought was truth. Any, anyway, hope you don't hate me but I can't stand back and lie. The truth hurts sometimes, I hope you understand. And so then I reciprocated him and I said, yeah, whatever, it's easy to be fooled or whatever. Um, you know, you gotta look at a few things about this one of the one guy, okay? I never had a bad word to say about him. He never said anything bad about me and he had months and months and months to make videos about me supposedly exposing me. You know, why wouldn't he have done it? Number, number two, he only does it at the very end when he's got nothing to lose because he's shutting down his channel. So in other words, in other words, I wouldn't have a chance to fight back. Okay, so then he does that. Then there's the other problems, and I've told other people this, and I'll tell you this myself now. I've told people along the way that, this is going to sound weird, but the voice doesn't match the hand movements. I do not believe the voice of the individual talking is the guy whose hands are in the video. Okay? The other thing is, the guy acts way too charismatic. Any guy that walks around saying, I love you, every 20 minutes is looking to get a blowjob. I don't love you, but at least I'll give you some information to work with. Okay? Another guy that does that shit is that fucking Scott Bug from Underground Believers. Oh, I just love you guys. I just love you. Fuck that. Just give the people the information and let them go to, go to take a lunch break. You ain't got to give them all this, I'm doing it because I love you. I don't fucking love you. And God, please don't love me back. But at least take what I give you and look at it. That's all. I'm not trying to be your buddy. Okay? And the, the other thing. This guy's going around, he's calling himself a prophet. Who the fuck does that? Who the fuck calls himself a prophet? That's something that somebody else gives you a name. You know, the disciples in the Bible didn't walk around and go, Hey, hey look at me. I'm one, of the I'm one of the disciples. Whoa, check it out. They were given that name later. Okay, when they came out the fishing boat, Jesus said, hey, you want to come hang with me? I'll make you into something. Okay, but you know, nobody walks around saying, I'm a prophet. What kind of silly? Yeah, I'm Jay Leno. That's why I'm sitting here with a fucking parrot, you know, collecting workman's comp. We both know that shit ain't true. Okay, and then, you know, I let a lot of things slide that we, people kept saying, well, listen to what he's saying. I don't know nothing about this Urantia book, so I'm not going to even get into that. I know nothing about it. I'm not qualified to speak for or against it. I do know that when you say that you're flying, that you know you've been in contact with aliens 500 times, there's something wrong because the guy did a video and he told you the deception was going to come from inside the Earth. Well, if that's the case, then how are you? How are you having contact with people from outer space? It tells me that you're communicating with the guys inside the Earth. Then the other thing is. He's a star child. He's a star seed. No, you're not, dude. At best, you're a fucking pumpkin seed. 
Okay, that's the bottom line. Maybe a radish seed. Because remember the video I did on radish? Well, you're a radish seed because a radish is a slang word for a fucking liar. Now, you did have a lot of, you did have a lot of good information. And this is what really got under my skin. A lot of times he was saying the same thing I was and he was doing a real good job of it. But I could never coax him to say the word Saturn. And so the girl regarding me won. Okay, she said, well, he doesn't want to bring that up because that's some people's religion and he doesn't want to upset them. And I thought, well, it's kind of kind of lame, but whatever. So I never pursued this guy. I never thought there was any problem until all of a sudden he starts running around. I'm flashing this. I'm doing that. Well, come on, dude. Oh, and then last night I made a video and I told him, get fucked. You know, I said, yeah, he's one. Yeah, he's he's a star child, all right, a, the dark star child. And so what's he do? He, he runs to YouTube and he, get, he he flags my video. Why? What are you afraid of, dude? I thought you're a prophet. What words can some fucking Jewish tree trimmer fucking have against you? So the bottom line is, so then he had that flag. So now I got a strike against my page, which is fine because I'm going to close that channel. And now I'm going to open up a new occult science channel because now another one of you motherfuckers, first it was Queenie, right? Then it was Eric. Then it was Aaron. And now it's you. So now you've been, now you've been exposed by your own followers because you threw them under the fucking bus. So Lottie D, motherfucker, go get a strike on me for this too. You call yourself a prophet? Who the fuck does that? Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Look at me. I'm a prophet. Looking good. Hey, stop by. Hey, you disciple. Always a pleasure. You know, come on, dude. Fuck off. You're all done, buddy. So, basically, that's what it is. So, uh, you know, um, I can... Uh, I'll post it so you can read it. And I'm not trying to bring no grief on a guy, but he told me it was okay to post it. The guy's name is Jay Cherry, whether you know him or not. Um... You know, whatever. Uh, I'm not trying to cause the guy any problems. So, and once again, I always got to keep it in the back of my head. This could just, this could, could just be a continuation or a twisting to get me to try and side up with somebody else. I don't know, but all I know is this one of the ones, guys. Bye, bye, buddy. Oh, one last thing. You say that you're one of the ones, but you never say what the one is. And see that you got regarding me one. Well, that makes you one of the other, or one of the two. So, which one of the ones are you? Because she's, she's regarding herself as one. Are you regarding yourself as one? Which means that she would be regarding herself as one. And then you guys would both be one of the two. So I don't know. It's all fucked up to me. What do I care? Anyway, see you later. Thanks for, thanks for trying to set me up in my 20 subs. You dope, you fucking moron.